Hey, hey, Jelly Toast here. I uh, just wanted to make a really quick video of my five star island in New Horizons. I just got it yesterday and I was really surprised that I got it because my island is still pretty not developed. There's still so much empty space and I didn't finish moving all my trees or my flowers. Um, but yeah, I always thought five star islands had to be super developed and super full of everything and whatnot, but nope. Got it. So I just wanted to make a video to show what my island looks like uh, for memories. Okay, let's do enter. I got these um, signpost things from playing Pocket Camp. So I laid down a whole bunch of pathway here for the main plaza. So like I have bench trees, Able Sisters, uh, Nooks is getting remodeled. Um, I have big fish out here to wait for CJ. I have tarantulas around the museum or flick. And yeah, this is my resident services. And then I want to just I wanted to make like a center plaza thing. I don't know what I want to make it yet. A lot of people seem to have like cafes or diners, and I'm like, yeah, that's cool, but I don't really want to feed, follow most people. But you know, maybe a dessert place would be nice. I don't know, I'm thinking about it. But anyways, back here behind the shops, I have gardens. So, ooh, let's catch that. <gasps> well, that was terrible. Anyways, um, yeah, so I have tulips here, the fencing. Ooh, another chance. Cosmos here, fencing. And um, Rose is here with fencing. Wow, so many stick bugs. Cool. So I laid them out white, red, yellow so that the white and reds can crossbreed to make pink and the reds and yellows can crossbreed to make orange. I know all the flowers back here, they won't have any space to crossbreed or anything. That's why I made the path look like this so that at least maybe one or two flowers will sprout from each end. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have put the cosmos in the middle because more different colored roses would actually be nicer. To switch that. But I don't have enough cotton. Whatever doll I'll grow. And then I want a little path here of trees so they alternate between hardwood and pear trees. Airs on my fruit. I wanted to do that because I wanted the different hardwood trees to reflect the season that we're gonna be in. And then the pear trees to be like, yeah, no, um, don't mind all this furniture. It's just random stuff that I left out there when my house used to be in this area. Um, I left it out to give my island more points for having stuff outside. But yeah, these are six hardwood trees that I still have to move that I don't know what to do with. This is a whole big empty area that I don't know what to do with. Two random trees there. Um, I have a river here with a waterfall. Two bridges across. Um, I originally only wanted to keep this one, but this one seems pretty useful and handy too, so I need to demolish it. Make it a nicer plain wooden one. I don't think I should do another Zen bridge. It's just... Anyway, you should come over here. Here's a campsite sign also from Pocket Camp. Um, more trees and a bunch of furniture. I really wanted to make it look like a campsite. Yeah, outdoor, co uh, outdoor cooking where... We sit here by the lighthouse, a DIY thing so that if um, campers come to ask for stuff I don't have to run all the way back to my house or anything, it's just right there. Although maybe I should move it to here where the dried squid is, then I don't have to move that far. Or maybe I should move it to where the hay bed is, move all of this down. Oh no, that might be better actually, I'll do that later. Right now I just want to show my setup for when I got 5 stars looked like. Okay, so we go up this ramp. I got a bajillion flowers. So another pear tree and a hardwood tree and more flowers here. Seriously, I kept all my flowers and trees. I think that helps my scoring go up. Um, so yeah, I want this place to be an amusement park. So yeah, popcorn, cotton candy, candy machine. I added fencing because I wanted like kind of a barrier so that people don't fall off the cliff. Ride, and I want to buy more horses to make like a pseudo merry-go-round thing. Slide. I have one of each tree here, cedar, fruit, um, hardwood. I think adding this fencing actually boosted my um, island to 5 star, adding this fencing and adding my garden fencing around my flowers earlier. And here's my orchard. Here's some pear trees, my money trees, cherries, um, peaches, and more ice. 
Oops, I have it on. Yes! Finally, did it the wrong way. Okay. Yeah, um, over here are oranges and apples. Yeah, except they're all. Damn it! Anyways, they're all not harvested because, I mean, they're not grown because I harvested them earlier. So. Hair trees and money trees here. Got a whole mess of bamboo here. And the incline is not properly placed. I'll have to move and destroy that, but I'll... Um, yeah. Added a waterfall, made a little outdoor bath area. You can sit here, drink some tree. <laughs> tree. Drink some tea. Eat some bamboo bento. Here you have a beautiful... Oh shoot, tiger. Oopsies. Beautiful bamboo path way to there. there. More flowers over here. But I'll show you that those flowers later. We cross this bridge. That is Fang's house. He's home. So I should check it out later. See if he's making DIY. But yeah, proof that I am a five star island. Lily of the Valley, which only grows when you have five stars. Also, I have the recipe for the golden watering can. Ah, oh, Marina's home also. But anyways, I have this center path thing. Uh, my house. I want to surround my house with blue and orange flowers, so that's why I have this. And I have two courtyard-like areas. I don't know what I want to fill up with that yet. But I will fill it up. And here I made a little pool area with a little cooler so I can change Damn it! Here's the orchard that we were at earlier. Again, this incline is not properly lined. It should be down here, but I will fix that later. Uh, Cole's house, Marina's house. I wanted my rabbits to live on the highest tier because, um, like, there's a Korean story that rabbits live on the moon. So I was like, oh yeah, if you're on the third tier, you're closest to the moon. So I thought that was cute. This incline also misaligned. I'm terrible at spacing things out. And Animal Crossing New Horizons should have a grid when you build things so that you don't misalign them. But yeah, whole mess of trees everywhere. I barely got rid of any trees. I just made sure to keep them all. And if I chopped one down, I made sure to plant another one. Um, but yeah, more trees, coconut trees, all these flowers. I placed them out this way so that I can try to breed blue flowers, but also to have flowers everywhere. Flowers, orange flowers, yay! I wanna breed them all, once I just overrun my island with blue and orange- Damn it! Blue and orange flowers, all my regular ones will be shunned into a small corner. Uh, I'll only keep them for future recipe purposes, but yeah. And also these flowers are in placeholders of the bushes. That are coming out soon in the update, but yeah. Annalise's house. This will be Zucker's house in the future. Uh, more manhole. Hi, Poppy. I think you were thinking. <laughs> Emblem blazer. Sure. Give me clothes. Um, but yeah, this road leads back to this main one. Dungeon of vending machine. This one leads to chairs that you can sit down. View the river. Cool, cool. And Zell's house. Poppy's house, but she's gonna be moving out. More path, utility pole. This is Lily's house and Jeremiah's house. More trees. And I made this custom design to make it look like they live on a lake with lily pad paths. It took three hours to do because it was so long and tiring. But I did it, because I love them. Okay, so we come back to this main area where Fang, Marina, and I live. Another kind of little mini pseudo bamboo path. And then we come to this big path. I want to definitely put blue and orange flowers on the sides because I don't know how long I want them to go. 
I don't know how wide I want them to be. I left this pond here just because, just so I have another pond on the lower floor. I'm trying to breed special colors of these flowers, so that's why I laid them out here. This is the bridge that connects the rest of my animals to the island. More coconut trees, stumps, bonfire. But yeah. This is next to resident services and the main plaza. This is just full of flowers that I am also trying to breed more colors of, but don't know where to place them. I don't know what I want to put on this big wide open area. These are flowers that are kind of extra and I don't know where to put them. Yeah, so much open space that I don't know what to do with that. That whole open space. I have this whole open space. I think once the hedges come out, I want to make a hedge maze. I do like mini mazes. Maybe I want to make like a little outdoor reading area. Oh wait, I forgot to show that my beach is also super furniturized. Beach towel. Anything I could possibly lay outside, I did. Another DIY station down here just in case something breaks or if I wanted to keep making bait to fish off the pier. So yeah, I think it doesn't have to be super um, developed your island to be 5 star, but you just need a bajillion flowers, a bajillion trees, um, a lot of fencing. I think that was my problem when I was still at 4 stars, and then I just built all this random fencing around my amusement park and garden area. Yeah, I was good with plants. Because I planted all this bamboo and never got rid of any of the old trees. Oh wait, I don't have I don't don't have any garbage. And I pushed I placed a lot of outdoor furniture. Yeah, I think that's it. That's what makes your island stars. Yeah. Don't know what I'm gonna do with all this open space, but hopefully I'll figure it out soon. But yeah, that was my five star island. So if you really want a golden watering can, super fat, like super quick, golden, golden watering can. Maybe if you want a lily of the valley super fast, then just do this. Leave a lot of open space to terraform later or do whatnot. But yeah, that's just my island. I still have so much to do. But... I need my store open so I can earn more money to buy more things. Now I'm rambling. I'm gonna end this here. Bye!